I'm Kimberly Dadamo Green. I'm a studio art teacher at Berkeley High School, and my students and I have developed a interdisciplinary arts-based research curriculum for juniors and seniors. The class is shaped around the pedagogy of arts-based research, which is basically the idea that big interdisciplinary topics can be explored deeply through the lens of art and artistic practice. So my investigation is mostly about genetics and how it influences our identity. My investigation is an exploration of my obsession with skateboarding. My investigation is reflecting on painful experiences in order to heal. I'm investigating monsters. My investigation is the different states of mind at different stages in youth. So uh, my investigation is uh, superheroes and how they reflect and represent society. One of the things that's interesting about this class is that we can't find another class that's like it in the world. Students design their own course of study, so they are immediately engaged at their own level. There's a lot of emphasis on metacognition and learning about learning. A great thing about this class is that it teaches you ways of thinking. So you can take those um, ideas that you learn in this class and then apply them in actual action in your other classes. The curriculum was collaboratively designed by my students and I over the past nine years with input from Dr. Julia Marshall at San Francisco State University School of Education. So my environmental science class that I took last year and my biology class that I'm in this year um, have a lot of overlapping kind of subjects with the research that I've been doing for my art. Really, what I study and what I research around monsters ties into everything because I'm learning about cultures in like the ancient world that I'm studying in history classes. I'm learning about, for other kinds of monsters, I'm learning about diseases that I'm studying in anatomy and in biology. I'm learning about cruel dictators that people often call monsters that I'm studying in my history class. In addition, there's a level of discipline maturity that you have to have, you know. Um, you can't just go into a class and like draw a picture. You have to know what ideas are behind that picture that you draw. So the workbook really is our kind of like a window into our minds. It's what we're thinking about, what we've researched, um, the process that we took to make our art. I love the transformation of students to artists. I really think we are developing a new way to teach art at the high school level.